I'm about to teleport. I didn't go that far at all. Hey, everybody, this is the last living game to you. Welcome back to more Luigi's Mansion. In the last episode, we completed Area 1 and unlocked... Well, technically, we did not unlock this door just yet. We're going to be doing that right now. And in this episode, we're going to be doing a lot of other stuff as well. So, well, for starters... Yeah, let's just skip this cutscene for now. Anyways, for starters, there is... Now, these... <sighs> okay. All right, there we go. Okay, now, for starters, whenever you see a vase like this... Check it until it gets treasure out because in every floor of this mansion This vase will always have at least these vases will always have at least one gold bar I forget which one has a gold bar in this area and over here if I'm not mistaken Okay, it hasn't a Get out of here ceiling surprise and yes, that's its official name ceiling surprise anyways if you go through here, you have a 20% chance of having a golden mouse appear, and yeah, that yeah, that's the other way that a golden mouse can appear. One of them is with cheese, the other one is with a 20% chance of appearing. Yeah. And it didn't appear just yet. Okay, I'm going to go in here to... Well, actually, there's something else that we need to take care of down here anyway, so if I'm not mistaken, that should have bills in it, but I'm probably going to get those later. Anyways, in here, you want to have the flashlight pointed up. Technically, you're not supposed to come down here until much, much later in the game, but I recommend doing it now because Speedy Spirit. You can only get this one this early in the game. You cannot get this one when you're actually supposed to get down here. And come on, let me get that last coin before getting the Sapphire. Okay, I'm gonna meet you back on the first floor hallway. And wouldn't you know, the golden mass appeared already. That was quick. Anyways, yeah, it contains two gold bars and a bunch of other stuff. Yeah, I'm not gonna show off on screen what each gold mouse or speedy spear gives you because, oh, that would make this let's play a bigger pain in the ass than it already is. Anyway, uh, come on. All right. Not so easy this time around. Anyways, I'm just going to check these. Ah, here's the gold bar. Okay, so I don't have to keep searching for it. Anyways, in the back hall, back of the hallway over there, there's also another gold bar all the way over there. Anyways, there's going to be a... Oh, I thought we were going to be introduced to a new ghost here at the moment. Apparently not. Anyways, I think it's in here. Yes! <laughs> Normally, they don't come in until like three or four tries. Hear a mysterious piano being played. Anyways, suck those mice in. Anyways, what we're supposed to do next is go into this room, which is already open. Anyways, I think you can open this up, get introduced to a new type of ghost. Yeah! <laughs> These guys are grabbing ghosts. They're my favorite ghosts, mainly because I just love the sound they make when you suck them up. It's like, yeah! <laughs> And okay, Mr. Super Hebrew is what I called him my last let's play. When he goes, get a little bit of trouble there. Maybe you need more training. Okay, yeah. When you first get introduced to the grabbing ghost, they'll sometimes grab you, and you have to move the control stick whenever you get caught by them. Because there are some grabbing ghosts that will suck away some of your HP when they grab you. Yeah, suck away some of your HP. Okay, God. <laughs> Oh, I made it sound like an innuendo without even trying to. Hooray. Uh, regardless. Anyways, that key that we got leads to a room over on the right of this hallway. Yep. Open it up. Because there is a lot of stuff that you can get here. Specifically a bunch of money that you can get into the chandeliers. And... Oh, introduction of Shy Guy Ghosts. Sometimes they dance in pairs, other times they'll just come after you. But what you want to do is just suck off their masks. Oh. And you can catch them both at once. Whoa! What? Okay, I've never seen that happen before. I didn't actually let go of the ghost until, it, until the other one got sucked into the vacuum itself. Okay, that normally doesn't happen at all. Anyways, I'm pretty sure... Ah! Gold bar! 
Okay, normally I don't don't get all this treasure so easily in the first day. Oh, the first time I come over here. Anyways. Surprised neither of them went into the separate directions, because that's what they normally do. <laughs> then again, that's probably probably has to do with the color of their outline. Or outline. Color of their shadow, I guess. Come on, okay. Now, what's kind of funny is that the red grabbing ghosts attack you in a different way than the other grabbing... I mean, the uh, grabbing ghosts. The red shy guy ghost attacks you differently than the rest of the shy guy ghosts. The red shy guy ghosts will try to stab you, the others will just twirl around their spear. Anyways, here is the next painting ghost. The dancing couple. You have to be spinning away from them and wait for them to bow. That's all you have to do. You can only see them on here on the spinning platforms, by the way. Okay. Come on, take a bow already. There we go. Okay, these spinning platforms will make it more difficult for you to catch them, but... I'm gonna try... Yes! I got them away from it. Okay, now let's see if I can get the gold... Do not eat the poison mushroom again! Oh, thank god. I've had that happen way too many times in this Let's Play already. Anyways, uh, come on, suck you two in, and, oh, hello. Grab it already, Luigi, jeez. They love the dark, and now they will get you, blue hair. I don't know why I felt the need to do that, yeah. yeah. Some of these paintings will appear repeatedly throughout the game, but I think this is the only room where that one in particular reappears, and I don't think any of those reappear as well. All right, so going through here. You're going to want to be careful because in this chair, it's a speedy spirit. Oh, I actually got it. Okay. Thank God. Okay. Now let's see if I can catch up the money without the purple puncher punching me to. Not to death. Okay. Ah, God damn it. Thanks. Thanks. So much, buddy boy. Okay, yeah. Luckily, they only do 10 damage. So, like, a New Game Plus, I remember them doing more than this. There we go. Okay, normally, I don't really get the Speedy Spirit until after that one in particular was sucked in. Yeah! <laughs> I just love it when video game stuff makes ridiculous sounds that you wouldn't expect them to make. And... Hey! Get off. Now, while I'm catching this, I want to show- I want to show off the song that plays whenever you catch a ghost. Oh, there you go. I know what you're thinking. What the hell of a kind of song is that? <laughs> it's like the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. Anyways, what's in here? Oh yeah, normally there would be a few coins in there, but oh well. Yeah, I have, like I said, I have gotten every single treasure in the game before, and I do know where all the gold bars are off the top of my head, but... Actually, wait, no. Oh no, heart. Okay. Yeah, I don't think there are coins in that. Place fixture. Now, you can probably see that there's, like, nothing in here, and... You're probably thinking, oh, I don't see anything here, I'll just leave, like, a typical person who didn't have game packs in 2001. No. You see this... Mirror over there. There's something in the back there. How about we observe what it is? Mm -hmm. And this is indeed required. Huh, wonder what happened there. Anyways, yeah, it looks darker in here despite the fact that there are actually some lights over there. <laughs> I don't know why. Anyways, danger. Let's suck that up and- ooh, button. Must press, must press. Wow, that didn't look like I pressed it at all. Who's there? Who dares to serve our sleep? Oh, who is Luigi? Look guys, Luigi's finally here. We're gonna do to you what you did to your brother only worse. The sign is back! It's a Yacht's Poltergeist 3000! Everybody scram! <sighs> Luigi, are you okay? 
That was them. Those were the ones who released all the ghosts from the paintings in my gallery. Those fiends. I wonder where King Boo and his gang had gone. So they were hiding in the mansion all along. Thanks for flushing about, Luigi. I think you found them, but perhaps it would have been better if you hadn't, well, let every single one escape. Just a thought. Ah, oh, well, water under the bridge. Anyway, she'd probably come back to the lab for a second. Alright, so... I've been waiting for you, Luigi. Your brother must have been taken by that gang of booze. Poor fella. Oh, no, don't talk crazy. They're not gonna eat the man. <laughs> They're not gonna eat the man. Uh, he hasn't come back. Now, common theory holds that booze grow in strength whenever they travel in numbers, and they must somehow combine their powers, too. Powered over likely well Mario. Okay, if you're aiming to save Mario, but there's one way to do it. Capture every boo and slowly weaken the group's power. Now, catching boos are actually somewhat different. And yet, yeah, he says that the Game Boy Horror has a secret function. It developed it secretly. It's called the Boo Radar. It flashes red whenever, yellow whenever there's a boo in the room. And it'll flash red whenever you're really close to one. Anyways, catching boos is actually quite different than catching regular ghosts. I'll show it off once we get into the first room. And in here, open that up. Yeah, you can see that there is a boo in the room if the boo radar flashes yellow. Now, there could be two possible locations. One of them could actually hold the boo. The other one could just hold a boo ball or a bomb. Uh, what? Oh, it's a painting. Okay, it actually held the boo. Now, boos come out when it's light when their lights are on. They do not. They, technically, well, they can't come out when the lights are off, but they do come. They can take damage when the lights are off, just not as fast as they do when the lights are on. So, I and personally, I would recommend catching them in the when the lights are on, and you actually cannot suck them up if the lights are off. No matter how hard I try, I try that out no matter what. I tried that out pretty hard, but it didn't work no matter how hard I tried, so yeah. I don't know why I was checking that table. Either way, going to the next room. Yeah, there could be... Again, I guess... I'm hope oh, okay, yeah, there's a... The, a boo could appear in two possible locations. One of them will actually have the boo. The other one will just have a boo ball, which does nothing. And a ba bomb Or as I like to call it, a boo bomb. <laughs> Me boo that yeah you can see these boo names are like puns off of stuff that you could see in like regular life real life like Bootha is a pun of Ber Bertha. Now I am deeply disappointed in t Nintendo for not having the word having a boo called bootiful. I just don't know why they wouldn't have that. Uh, anyways, come on. Ah, uh, ball. And oh, heart. Alright. Wanna play Game Boo Advance? To be fair, I already have a Game Boo Advance linked to my GameCube that allows me to play Game Boo Advance games on the GameCube, so yeah, personally, I'm okay with not having a Game Boo Advance. Well, to be fair, I much rather play my video games on an actual TV instead of just handheld. That's probably why I've grown less attached to my 3DS, so. Well, then again, I'm pro I don't plan on playing any 3DS, let's playing any 3DS games, because one, I don't have a 3DS capture card, and two, 3D, the 3D, the guy who makes 3DS capture cards stopped making them a while back, so I'm probably not going to be doing that, probably not going to be getting one that much. I only have, like, a handful of games I would let's play on the 3DS anyway. Well, actually, the regular DS, not necessarily 3DS. So, oh, shipping a bottle. Ah, bomb, come on. Uh, oh. Light fixture. And here we go. Speak not my name. Taboo. Now what's also... Uh, uh, what the... Okay. He decided not to go into the other room. Apparently he felt pity. Pity for me. You're on fire, Luigi. <laughs> yeah, get, yeah. You get says some really funny stuff whenever you catch a boo. Now, what's different from boo, that's different. What makes boos different from other ghosts most importantly is that whenever they that you they can actually go into different rooms, and when they do that, yeah, it makes them pretty hard to catch. Although, although that's probably the point that Nintendo wanted to prove. That's probably something that Nintendo wanted to do mainly because there are boos that have like 300 HP later in the game and. Yeah, they didn't want to make this game too easy for catching the boos. Yeah, catching a boo is basically a save point, as you already saw. Uh, what the? Oh. Pfft. 
Ah, oh, losing the stool. <laughs> Boolicious. Seriously? Boolicious? That's not even a pun, that's just bad. There's no stopping you, Luigi. Take a roo -ha. You've already found five boos. You're boo snaring maniac. <laughs> I love this guy. I understand you're worried about your brother, young Luigi fella. But just take it easy. You have plenty of time still, so try to keep your shirt on. Why not go to the washroom and splash water on your face? Anyways, yeah, that's where we're supposed to go. Yeah, there's another thing that he said that had plenty of time. You have plenty of time. Now, that's something I wanted to go over while I'm heading over to the washroom. Ooh, money, 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 money. Something I wanted to go over while I was heading to the washroom. Luigi's Mansion had a lot of changes from the beta. This game had a lot of changes ever since his beta was tested. So basically, basically, what? Okay, apparently the boo and the boo bomb were in the same place. Anyways, this game was originally gonna have a 24 hour time limit in real time. If you did not, if you did not save Mario within that 24 hour time limit, you would have, the mansion would have disappeared and Luigi would have fell into a tremendously deep depression. I don't want to show a picture of it on screen because those of you kids who are, who are watching along, you are going to be really scared of the face that Luigi makes. <laughs> Seriously, you just look it up on your own. I really don't want to show it on screen because it's going to be really creepy even to me. Somebody who does not scare that easy. Anyways, yeah, there's a lot of other beta changes that we have not yet gone over, but I'm going to go over those when it's relevant. Either way, going down here, there are two more boos that we can obtain right now. And one of them's in this room. And yeah, they can appear in the chairs that are in the corner or in this painting right here. And boo bomb. Oh, oh I'm surprised I found one in those chairs automatically. Boo la la. Okay, I am really disappointed in Nintendo for this even more because that's supposed to be a part of ooh la la, but it's actually pronounced oh la la. I've taken French in middle school. I know how that is pronounced. A lot of people don't. I mean, what the hell? Uh, it pisses me off when people say ooh la la instead of oh la la because oh la la is actually how it's pronounced, not ooh la la. I am disappointed in Nintendo deeply for that, getting that wrong. Anyways, Game Boo. I'm not gonna play you, you're not a Game Boo color. Well, then again, I know Raptor Special is a Game Boo color, even though the only game I probably play on the Game Boo color is Pokemon Crystal. Anyways, eight boos captured. This is the most amount of boos that you can, you can capture at this point without continuing on in the story. So, for now, we are going to head to the washroom like Egad wanted us to. And, ooh, candelabra. That wasn't there before. Open this up. Pretty sure there's money in that cap. Yes, there is. And there should also be money. No, 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 no. Want that poison mushroom to disappear. Going to two rooms away. And let's hope that that mushroom does not reach. Uh, it's probably still there. Okay, thank God it's not bouncing. <laughs> wow. Camera glitch? Or, no. Animation glitch on the poison mushroom, seriously. He's like, ah, I saw something really important in the toilet. I didn't mean to. Good lord. Some of those voice cracks sounded intentional, but I swear they're not. Don't worry about it. Hey, Ray, no point crying over spilled milk. I've never understood why people cry over spilled milk to begin with. I suppose it's just flush it all worry away. Oh, really bad fun. I'll just let it swell down the depths of my happiness refill my life. <sighs> Kinda sounded like Ego Raptor's impression of Toad there, jeez. <laughs> Anyways, so you check the toilet like he wanted, to, like he hinted off. You get a key, it leads all the way down there. Okay, I think this will be a good time to end the video off. Next time on Luigi's Mansion. We're gonna be heading down to that room that that the key that we just got opens to. See you guys then.